Man, this test is insane. I don't know what else is gonna be waiting for us. A Kelpie. Don't see many of those in these parts. She must be theirs. Will she take us to them? I'll ask her. Nicely. Easy, girl. Easy. That's right. Good. Care to talk about whatever the norms put you through? No. Get on. That's a good lass. Lovely creatures, but temperamental by reputation. In my land, they'd keep children away from the lost by telling them a Kelpie would drown them. Of course, no Kelpie I know would do such a thing. Unless it was disrespected. It walks on water. Aye. No mystical water steeds to speak of in Greece, brother? Hmm. There were the Hippocamps. They served the Sea God. I battled one upon a Titan. <laughs> that might not be her favorite subject. Oh, nice! Okay, for a second I thought we were gonna fly, but we're actually going underwater. This is awesome. Hideaway. Never doubted we'd make it. And that is weird. Can we just go in or are they gonna try to kill us? Kratos, Freya, and Mimir's head. Enter the home of the Norns. Tentatively. Finally reached their destination. Kratos speaks first. I, I seek, seek my, my son. son. <laughs> you know the child is an Asgard. No, you seek what all who search for us seek to know the ending to your story. The ghost of Sparta furrows his brow menacingly. He resists the urge to grunt. No, oh. oh, he fails. You come to us, piteous archetypes, seeking freedom from your scripts, as if knowing your lines would grant you the power to rewrite them. Speak plain. <laughs> you will die, Kratos of Sparta. But you called him the destroyer of fate. There must be a way to subvert destiny. There is no destiny, Puck. The protagonists are speechless. They do not understand. There is no grand design, no script. Only the choices you make. That your choices are so predictable. Merely make us seem prescient. When my son was born, shut up! <laughs> Your prophecy said he would die a needless death, and he did. Because you could not let him go. Because he thirsted for revenge. And because you kill gods. But what Kratos did, it was not out of hate. Should I bring him a crown then? He still slays gods, but now he's sad about it? You are the sum of your choices, nothing more. And because your choices never change, you will learn that Heimdall intends to kill your son in Asgard, and you will do what you do best. And then Ragnarok. The skies burn, the curtains fall. Exunt omni. Heimdall. Huh. Again, he misses the point. <laughs> Focusing on the second act, to the exclusion of the final. A common mistake in storycraft. We are yeah, leaving. leaving. He stomps away, 
followed closely by Freya. I enjoyed your story, Kratos. Pity it has to end so soon. <laughs> well, that was educational. <laughs> yeah, I did not like those norms at all. Very rude and annoying. And very mean. Yeah, I did not like them one bit. Let us leave this place. Happily. But it looks like Kratos is gonna die. Unless he'll somehow come back from the death, I have no idea. But everything is pointing to Kratos dying. That's better. I can feel things getting more normal already. Wait. That tree. Well. Isn't that interesting? What is this? That's the noose, brother. The one Odin hanged himself with. As part of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. Brother, what they said about the boy? Will not happen. Oh, I agree. It will not happen. We will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how? You wouldn't seriously consider killing Heimdall, would you? I will do what I must. Oh, is that all? You're wrong to dissuade him, Mimir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, vicious little shit. And so loyal, Odin entrusted him with Galahorn. If we have the chance to eliminate him before Ragnarok, we shouldn't hesitate. Considering his powers of foresight alone, that is an if of mountainous size. I would not miss Heimdall at all. I don't like that guy. He doesn't like... Um, he doesn't like Atreus either. I really hope going back is going to be Even a lot easier we're all than coming this way. Comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a mite rusty at that measure. We've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't doubt that, brother, but it's hardly my point. <laughs> okay, there's one there. Can we get it? I think we can. Kratos, I see something. Okay, I don't think it's always good when you see something, because okay, there is there. something. <laughs> yeah, when Freya sees something, it might be something bad. We're missing the Norn's message here. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Freya. I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Their accusation was cruel. None of us believe... The truth can be a cruel thing. Anyone care to argue with that? No. But Baldur's fate had many causes. Prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur. And so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Then we agree. It would be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is my... Your nature. Well played, Norns. <laughs> All 
Alright, going back for now is a little bit easier. But that was insane. Finding those norms, passing all those tests. Let us find a gateway. Return home. Consider our plans. Listen, brother. Before you make any hasty decisions, why don't you blow off a little steam? I'm sure there was some loose end we meant to circle back to. Give your mind a little time to process everything. I suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake, though I'm certainly happy to spend time somewhere other than Midgard. It's your Upgrade. choice, brother. Mm. Let's see. All right, let's see where we have to go. We're gonna go back to Sindri's. Like he reads the person, sees their intention. My intent will be to kill him. Knowing that will be no advantage. Brother, this is no one to underestimate. Any move you make, he'll have seen it coming. If you must face him, we need something else. An edge. Humor me? Very well. We will ask the dwarves. Ah, the inevitable asking of the dwarves. Oh dear, oh dear, what's to be done? What would you like? What is it you want? It has come to my attention that Nithog has been slain, and as a result, her offspring have been let loose into the Nine Realms. What of it? Unfortunately, without a proper role model to supervise them, the little rascals are certain to fall to mischief. In time, said mischief could culminate in nothing less than their devouring of the Nine Realms entirely. In order to avoid such a grisly fate, I'd like you to bring the lean worms to me. I believe I can act as a satisfactory paternal figure in their upbringing. You'll find the specimens gnawing on tears throughout the realms. Use this device to safely store them, bring them back to me, and I promise I'll make it worth your while. You mean to say you'd raise them by yourself? Indeed. I have no small experience managing extreme personalities. Compared to wrestling with my emotions in the most literal of senses, I dare say raising a hand. Quiet. Any questions before you travel on? I might sell that. I don't know. We'll see. They're back. They're back. Simmer down. I see them. I have news. Oh. Did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his advantages, I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Sindri, go get Dropnir. Dropnir? But we need him. Our supplies. Oh, we got plenty. And to spare. Even if we did, Dropnir's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. I suppose there's nothing to do, but... Go fetch Dropnir. Okay, so that's what I have to do. Cool. Dropnir? I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Dropnir. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. I will help me kill Heimdall. Never you mind all that. 
It's a fucking surprise. We're artistes. But to even store Dropnir, you'd need... You were saying... Now you intend to kill Heimdall. Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought I understood, my son is in danger. You will not allow harm to come to him. you little one. Got it! I think. What should be the wrong one? I thought you didn't believe in fate. We are all worried about your son. We Enough! Heimdall's a threat, not only to Atreus, but to everyone. He's Odin's left hand, and he carries the horde that begins Ragnarok. If we have the chance to eliminate him, we then should... it's just as likely a trap, because the bastard knows your intentions. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Not one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention, we'll have to visit... The lady. Oh. Oh. Whew, that's a relief. <laughs> uh. Ow. Kratos, whenever you're ready. No idea what he's on about, brother. I wish you'd come with us, dear. I know you mean. See you out there. You wanna go to Svartheim? See a lady? What lady? Ah, time to go see the lady. I'll take it from here. Oh no! This whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock will go. What? No, no, no. I you have to. heard him. Quit your fret. I ain't gonna mess nothing up. What the? <sighs> no, you pimp shrimps. Think that'll keep us out? Well, think the fuck again. What was all that then? Oh, just Sindri trying to hog all the glory. Same old shit. Not that. The gate. What's wrong with a bloody gate? Most likely someone in need of a lair been making a fuckery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursioning you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. Old Brock came prepared. I got ways in and out from the old days. Gates did never even think to look for, on account of being stupid. Brock, where are we? This here's your stop. Abandoned service tunnel, direct to the forge camp. I'll meet you up there. Go on. Brock. And he's gone. You sure he was the right pick for this, brother? I trust him. He speaks plain. And yet so colorfully. Unusual surface here. Elvish. 
Marsh, I think. Okay, we'll do that, but I want to explore what we have here. Okay, let's see what's behind door number one. I oh, just hack silver. All right. I'm full on health, but why not? Wait, pray I can do this. What? There. We keep cooperating, maybe someday it'll be Asgard in place. That is not my goal. Doesn't mean it's not your destiny. What are you insinuating, Highness? Not a thing. Hold on, take the silver. Why would he hide in here? He feared something in these tunnels more than he feared starving. Hardly seems rational. Fear seldom is. Alright, how do we open that door? Guess we'll have to blast our way. That barrel by the gate should do the trick. So, a tunnel for liquor and explosives. A little on the nose for dwarven culture, isn't it? Ridiculing a culture you helped undermine. Classic Aesir. Oh, all right. Might have earned that one. Oh, seriously, long tongue. Well, I can see why it's an abandoned service tunnel. Careful, brother. That looks flammable. Hey, we gotta go that way. Let's see if I can blow this up. No, I can't. Okay, but we should be able to do something with this. But it doesn't look like we can.
Another oil spill. Ah, a fortuitous oil spill. It's fortunate for us. Rage is full, but why not? There's gonna be something bigger here. Okay, let's let's keep Kratos. going. Kratos. Please listen. You have to let me take Brock's place. He can't talk to the lady. He mustn't. No. Do not ask again. But Oh dear. <sighs> okay, why? He's gone? Let's just see what we find. I think there's some chests here. <laughs> so wh I wonder why he can't talk to the lady. It's not his fault Atreus ran off, you know. Or are you just being Brock's champion? There it is again. You're insinuating and you know it. Can't the smartest man alive put it together? The giants conceal a mysterious figure who changes the fate of Ragnarok, and you're oblivious to the only rational candidate. The one who's fought wars against God and God. I am not their champion. Well, we're each entitled to our opinion. I guess let's keep going. Ah! 
Where there's a gear like that, there's usually a chain somewhere. Yes, but where? The sigil arrows should work with ice as well. Yeah, that's what we'll have to do, but I need to find the chain first. Where is the chain? Have we been here? We've been here. I didn't see any chains. Oh, there it is. These gates seem to be connected. See if you can break that far fixture. Actually, we'll do this. Let go. Come on. Alright, that was weird. But you should let go, right? Okay, I know how. Now I know what that mirror is for. Let go. Guys, like, all right, all right, we don't have a stone, damn it. This dude is actually kind of tough. Oh, 
Yeah, I really hope that I'm not gonna need the rage later we'll need on. To get one of those gates open. Okay, let's see what's here first. Ah, we've seen these troughs before, haven't we, brother? Okay, we can probably do something with this. Because there's some stuff over there. I just don't know what to do with these. Two ways that we can redirect the water to get that wheel turning. Oh, right. We can freeze the water, right? Probably. The water rushing above us, to be clear. Oh, that water. Okay. Can I do this one? Apparently not. That worked. Shall we? This opinion of yours. Was that the reason you proposed this alliance? You expect me to lead your armies at Ragnarok? That is Tyr's job. Not mine. It's plain to see Tears no war god anymore. Nor am I. I have left that life behind. Not killing gods you haven't. Or else what are we doing in this realm? Forging this weapon? Your choice. You know where it might lead. I am only protecting I my... know. I know. And we both know the places protecting your child can take. Hey Freya, can you like light that up? Alright, not this way. We can get this one. So we definitely don't want to go back that way. Let's try to chain it. Unless we can blow up one of these barrels. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, to be honest. I kind of want what's in this chest. 
Because it might be health, it might be more rage. Let's see, maybe... Okay, that worked. I don't know how to chain it. I um I don't know. I might come back to this. We're just gonna keep going. Are we getting close? What's going on? I know, I see. I know, I see him. Shit, I'm gonna die. Oh, these guys are purple, so they're tougher. Damn it. Kratos, we need you. Shit, I did that too late. But yeah, these enemies are getting tougher. Let's do this. Where are they? Wait, am I going the right way? This, not this way. Where 
Where is that freaking thing? I could really use this. Atreus's mother was a giant, isn't that right? She was one of the Yotnar. Yes. I didn't mean she was tall as a house. I, I know not all giants are giants. Not that there's anything wrong with a disparity in size. Or number of limbs, see. Nothing in the world. Alright. Can we blow this up? Yeah. A little... Too much. But... Wait. I did nothing. We're supposed to go up here. Wrong weapon. we can open the other gate why is it you ask i was just thinking of how odin antagonized the giants for generations nearly wiped them out of existence twice mm. now you may have a role to play in stopping him once and for all don't you think it's possible that's what your wife would have wanted do not presume to know what she wanted i'm not saying anything you haven't thought her secrets haunt every step of your path wasn't it Maybe if you talked about your doubts, they wouldn't explode when you talked to your son. I do not doubt. She knows what I left behind. She would never have asked that of me. She saw your fate. Three of Odin's kin dead because of the path she put you on. You don't think she knew exactly what it meant sending you to Jotunheim? This is mere conjecture oh. and probably quite enough of it, Highness. We're all making an effort to cooperate here, after all. Okay, right. is this flowing the right way? It's not for me to say. It is. Okay. All right. Let's get that wheel turning. That's a start. Let me know ah, if I can teamwork. There's two of them, and they're angry. Oui. We need you. Yeah. All right, these guys are tough. Oh, bugger. There's two of them. And they're angry. Oh, snap. Man. You're on fire, Kratos! It will pass! 
this guy all right that wasn't easy well, who's ready for some fresh air after that everyone what's gonna come out of here it is close but I can feel it all right, nothing came out to kill us, which is good. Look, I wasn't trying to provoke you or cast doubt on your marriage. It just seems to me your thoughts haven't caught up to your instincts yet. And there is something else. are close when we get out of here I'll give you some space let you think carefully about whether you're ready for what it means to make this weapon and to use it <laughs> meanwhile I'll see what else I can learn while we're here Maybe I'll send a few Ain hair yar back to Valhalla for good measure. Well, you have fun now. Hey, you made it! About time. I got everything all set here. Now we just gotta push on up to the fort. Folky, 